You said yesterday the stakes could not be higher as the Supreme Court prepares to weigh in on the abortion pill case. Can you give us a sense of how the president is watching this decision today? Who's briefing him? What is his response? Well, his senior advisors will continue uh, to brief him throughout the day. As you just said, uh, uh, this is uh, this is a high priority. We're cl clearly keeping a close eye on this and what the decisions uh, what decisions may come down uh, from this. Look, uh, as we know, this as you just mentioned, the stay the stay will expire. Uh, tonight, uh, and we are prepared. We are prepared for uh, any outcome the Supreme Court may may issue, and we are prepared for a long legal fight if necessary. You've heard me say this before, uh, and we will continue. We will continue to stand with FDA's evidence-based approval of mifeprestone. As we know, that's been around for more than 20 years. It's it's uh, it is used in more than 60 countries, and we will continue to support FDA's independent uh, expert authority to review, approve, and regulate a wide range of prescription drugs. Uh, Again, as you just stated in your question, the stakes could not be higher, and we are going to continue to fight. Uh, that is the commitment that this president, this administration has made, and uh, we are going to continue to protect uh, women's uh, women's reproductive rights. That is something that we have said since the Dowd uh, decision came down uh, this past this past uh, uh, summer in June. You say you're prepared. Can you give us a sense of what those preparations are in case the stay is not extended? What can you tell American women who are worried about these restrictions going into effect? Well, what we can tell American women is that we're going to continue to fight. Uh, we've been very clear about that. We feel that the, the law is on our side here. Uh, and uh, clearly, we're going to wait to see what the court decisions will be later, uh, later at some point today. As we know, the deadline, uh, the this day will expire tonight. But this is something that the president, the vice president, has been very clear on. We are going to continue to fight for women's reproductive rights. Uh, this is something where the majority of Americans uh, agree with us on. And so, uh, again, this is a fight that we are willing to have, that we will continue to have, and that we we have been having. Uh, and that's what uh, the women, millions of women across the country uh, can can really count on when it when it comes to this administration. Just one more specific. Are you looking at prescribing this off label? Is that something one of the options? I'm just not going to I'm not going to get ahead of uh, of uh, uh, of any any actions that we will be taking. Uh, what I can say is that we will uh, continue to fight and we are prepared for whatever uh, decision is made on this today.